Hello, everybody, and uh, have a good day. Uh, my name is Christian Zelmore. I'm part of Oracle's uh, cloud system sales engineering team here in Romania. And uh, we have the pleasure today to have uh, a dear guest invited, Banca Transylvania, and a representative from, uh, from part of the bank, uh, Mr. Adrian Denitsoyu. Uh, Mr. Adrian, please uh, give us some information, some background information about your role and about your company. Hello, everybody. I'm Adrian Denitsoyu. I'm uh, IT Operations Director in Banca Transylvania. And uh, from uh, this uh, position, I'm uh, in charge uh, also with the infrastructure, um, all aspects of infrastructure like uh, management um, and maintenance and also the acquisition and um, the part of a project uh, for a new, new investment. Um, I work in Banca Transylvania. Banca Transylvania is one of the 34 banks in Romania, the largest one, in fact, with about 80%, 18% of the market share. Uh, it's a bank that started the activities uh, 27 years ago. Um, in, and uh, right now we uh, have uh, around uh, 500 uh, branches in 180 cities and uh, we um, uh, have um, rough, let's say, 3.2 uh, million uh, customers from the uh, uh, Romanian market. Um, we um, manage the infrastructure, infrastructure for um, uh, for, for hundreds of uh, applications. Um, many of them uh, use uh, Oracle infrastructure on a database application and uh, infrastructure layer. Great, great. Uh, thank you, Adrian, for sharing that. Uh, we know that uh, your uh, company had a great uh, journey with us uh, in the past decade. Uh, we know that you're using quite a lot of uh, engineer systems, uh, Exalogix, uh, Exadata, PCA, uh, ZFS storage appliances. Uh, can you please share us uh, share some details about uh, the the current uh, platforms, Oracle platform that you are using, and maybe also some uh, application layers? Yes, um, we uh, we use a lot of. Um... Oracle engineer systems um, from uh, starting with the V2 as uh, uh, first uh, equipment that uh, we installed in Banca Transylvania and having all the flavors of Exadata till the most recent ones. As you already said, we have also Exalogic for uh, application and middleware layer. We have um, uh, ZFS for uh, storage. We have also some um, um, other uh, infrastructure for uh, backup or uh, we, uh, in the recent, recent times, we use uh, PCI for uh, virtualization uh, layer and uh, uh, so, some of our critical applications are posted on this uh, infrastructure. Um, mainly all the, the applications that are labeled as uh, critical for Banca Transylvania are stored uh, on Oracle infrastructure. We have a uh, uh, database of uh, core banking stored on Exadata. We have the application layer of FlexCube, uh, the core banking system uh, posted on Exalogic. Uh, we use um, also uh, for CAL system a combination of Exadata, Exalogic, and some X servers to, to host this uh, platform. We also use Supercluster for uh, one of our internet banking solution. Uh, and I use uh, some um, Exadata for uh, other systems like uh, CRM or um, uh, other critical uh, applications. Um, in fact, uh, in the last years, uh, we uh, started the process to consolidate uh, everything that uh, requires solid uh, database activities on these uh, Exadata machines. Uh, because as I already told you, we have a lot of Exadata machines acquired in, in time. And um, it proves that it's uh, the best solution to, to post uh, these uh, databases. That's great, Adrian. Uh, it's, uh, it's important uh, that you are next to us uh, in this journey. And we are very happy to, to, help, to help you in this uh, 
all other challenges that you will be facing. Uh, we know that recently we have um, uh, helped you with a, a recent project that uh, I know that you are working on. And uh, please tell us uh, about uh, the innovation part of the migration process that uh, the bank is using uh, to uh, refresh uh, one of those uh, core platforms. Um, well, as I already told you, we use uh, for uh, core banking uh, FlexCube as application that is uh, hosted on um, Exadata and uh, Exalogic uh, um, infrastructure. Uh, this um, architecture is uh, the same from the um, from the first time when we implemented uh, this uh, uh, core banking with uh, two uh, let's say technical upgrades, mostly due to some uh, need to to have more performance and also because uh, we have a policy not to have uh, in production uh, systems that are no longer in support from manufacturers. So we, uh, in this uh, history of more than 10 years then uh, uh, using the FlexCube, we made some uh, only infrastructure changes. Right now, uh, we want to make an uh, upgrade for uh, the application and we choose the la latest uh, uh, version of uh, FlexCube of 14.4, uh, a version that uh, is uh, quite new and uh, with uh, very few implementation, let's say, uh, in, so we don't have uh, uh, somebody to, to ask about their experience and uh, to see how uh, things should be done, other than the producer that, and uh, this is uh, you, Oracle. Um, also, this uh, change uh, in application is also a major change in uh, application architecture. So right now, a lot of uh, components of the application that used to uh, work in uh, da database layer are uh, right now moved into the application and middleware uh, part of the, of the solution. So we have to choose a um, good infrastructure solution that will support not only the database where it was in the past the load, but also the, the application layer where a lot of load is right now uh, moved. Um, we uh, also another challenge is the fact that being uh, core banking, we cannot uh, say, okay, let's stop this system, make an upgrade and then see what's happened. It's a pro project that uh, runs for one and a half year and uh, will have to be done in parallel with the day-to-day uh, -day business. And also the impact to the business should be uh, as uh, uh, little as possible. That's why we cannot use the same infrastructure that we have right now for the FlexCube to, for the new version. So we have to, to move to a new infrastructure. A new infrastructure, this is an easy choice when talking about databases. It's also Exadata, the latest one. But when we are talking about the application and middleware layer, we have to choose something different than Exalogic, which is no longer a solution for this layer. We will we choose to go with the PCA as a platform. We already used PCA in the past for some other applications, so we think that this should be a good candidate also for, uh, for this uh, application. Uh, we have a very um, tight dead deadline to, um, uh, to ensure that the, the chosen uh, architecture is the right one. In, uh, when we are talking about performance, when we are talking about volumes, and uh, also to have an infrastructure that will be uh, supporting for the next, uh, let's say, five to 10 years, because it's uh, core banking is not a system that where we can do hardware upgrades uh, every day. Um, we uh, right now are testing this uh, combination. We have to overpass also the uh, lack of uh, infiniband connection between the system, something that we had in the past, and uh, it proved to be a good uh, networking solution. Right now we are, we have this uh, uh, lack of uh, infiniband, but uh, I think uh, that the results we have till now uh, are promising and uh, uh, it will be the infrastructure that we will uh, need for, for the project.
Great, great, great. Okay, okay, Adrian. Thank you very much for sharing. Uh, we are very happy to to hear that uh, the the core banking, the most critical uh, component of, of your innovation layer, uh, and uh, the experience with the customer will be uh, upgraded. And uh, we are happy to see that uh, you have chosen a, a platform that you can build on. Now, uh, we would like to know about the the ratios of consolidation that maybe you have done in other other projects and uh, maybe some uh, performance number that uh, the bank is target uh, to reach okay um, regarding consolidation we have uh, some projects in the last uh, years uh, in order to uh, move uh, as much as uh, possible the uh, critical and important system into uh, exadata uh, machines because uh, of the performance and also because of uh, uh, reliability of these uh, machines. We um, consolidated, uh, for, um, for example, the data warehouse uh, infrastructure with uh, the, well, the, the CRM that we uh, use on the same uh, Excel data environment uh, because these two systems also uh, communicate a lot between them and it's a good choice to have that one. The same platform. Uh, we moved also some uh, system using collection, uh, also on exadata infrastructure and the same um, pro proximity with the data warehouse because a lot of uh, information was taken from data warehouse for this uh, collection process. Also, uh, all uh, card related uh, systems, I mean, anti fraud, um, authorization, issuing, and so on, are uh, consolidated on the same uh, Exadata infrastructure on some machines. So, we have uh, right now uh, about uh, uh, six uh, important Exadata machines that, that host uh, about 10 uh, critical uh, app applications. Um, the, by consolidating this uh, card infrastructure, for example, we uh, managed to achieve um, a good uh, ratio for transaction per second. Uh, we have uh, the goal to uh, go somewhere around 200 or 300 transactions per second um, for peak uh, times, because uh, right now we have peak time that uh, goes over 100 and uh, keeping in mind the um, business growth, then we should be ready for days like uh, Black Friday or some uh, holiday season to, to double this uh, number of transactions per second. Um, till now, uh, all uh, the bottlenecks we have uh, to, in uh, reaching uh, uh, high amounts in uh, performance were not on the infrastructure layer, but on the application design, let's say, and we managed to, to, serve, to surpass also these uh, bottlenecks. That's great, Adrian. We thank you, Oracle. We thank you for this uh, journey that you take uh, together with us. We'll be here to uh, help you in all the needs that you will need. And uh, we hope to be uh, your choice for the next uh, projects. And uh, we hope to overachieve all the proposed targets. Thank you. Thank you also. Thank you for your support in well, at least last 10 years. And uh, we know we can uh, count on you on all our pro processes and projects in the future. Goodbye.